It would make him look completely incompetent, which he is. Revelio. I bet he knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Rebellion. Rebellion. Thank you for the follow, man. Yeah, 
This is nice. Interesting. Bruh. Welcome back. What's good? How you doing, man? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We are trying to clear spaces because right now it's too packed right now. Too many things and I only have 20 slots. Eh, does this look good? This looks good, right? Yeah. Here. Ooh, it's a plum sorceress hat. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm trying to see if I can wear this. Does it? Oh, wow, increase the. <laughs> oh my god. Am I really going to do that? No, I cannot do this to him. I cannot do this to him. Bro. But. I am going to change glasses though, because this is getting a little bit ridiculous. Oh yeah, if you're trying to do the sound... There we go. Congratulations, you found the key to annoy a lot of people from time to time. I only got one coin, what the heck is going on? Where is the thing coming from? Eighty-eight, do not teach him this, okay? <laughs> And his name is John Cena! There it is! I was looking for this. Professor Sharp's Aura Badge. Oh, alright. This is the last one. It's okay, man. You can, you can do as much as you want, just, you know, at ease, alright? Okay, potions class, guys. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mm. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety in the of injuries. In it can heal some in the, injuries, but not in all. The bini, in the Beningi... In the Beningi... Point for Before yeah. today's class in is the... completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Wow! You like my outfit? Use a strong, even motion and his when name is John your C Please be meticulous when adding out of your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. Wow, I didn't know it's so tedious, man. How he do one drop like that? I have no idea. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredient you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. 
and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Professor Sharp said that Wiganweld Potion can treat... My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Oh my, why do you want to know? Yes, but why does that matter to you? Brilliant! And it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. <gasps> Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Weasley! Pleasure to meet you. Wait, a are Weasley. you to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single fooper feather. Fooper. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. I'll get you the fooper feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fooper feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Cool. Didn't expect to see a fooper. F whooper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. A well prepared witch Mongrel fur. Oh. Ashino eggs. Nice. Revelio. And some feathers. The potion should not be that color, Miss McDowell. Here's the fopper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Fopper. Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. I miss a chest. You should get back to brewing your Adjurus oh, potion. Really? And I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. I missed a f What? Seriously? No, no, no. Is this the chest? Revelio. Is that the chest you're talking about? Yep, already did. That's the one with the big, uh, the the big hat, you know, the one we saw just now. Should you chop the didney or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. Brew an endurance potion. Okay. Wow. Oh, okay. A potion that enhances a drinker's defense by covering them with a durable rocky skin. You know what? Perhaps this might be what I need to fight against some bad guys, you know? How was your date yesterday? It was fantastic. Man. Ah, nice. I need some hocklum juice for this. And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Aha, it doesn't yeah. work. Yeah. Ooh. Dragon dog. What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Wow. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. Oh, no. Why, bro? Why? Now I'm going to be in trouble. Remember. Fine job brewing your first Wiccanweld potion. But there are many potions yet to learn. This is going to be a busy year. Answer. Wasn't expecting that literally to blow up in my face. It was rather brilliant, though. I'd better clean up. You should finish brewing your potion if you haven't already. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, what'd I do? 
do I confess or do I just play like I don't know anything? Well, obviously he already caught me, so you know, if I say I don't know, then obviously he's, I'm going to be on his bad boy book, you know. Hoverpuff is honest, of, of course. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. Yeah. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Cool. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Yeah. Okay, we are done with potions. That's cool. Hey, level up. Oh, nice. Alright, so quest time. Let's see. Girl from. Oh, oh yeah, we're going to Hawks. We're going Hawksfield next. Hawksfield next. Let's go. It's a long walk though to Hawksfield. There is like literally no other way. Uh, oh, wait, no. I can go to the world map. I can teleport, right? I cannot teleport. It looks like I have to walk all the way. Jesus, man. This is going to be a long walk. Okay, you know what? We'll walk. We'll walk, okay? Let me see how do I get to the... Bruh. Let me get out of here first. Ah, yes, alright. Okay, at least I can start from there. <laughs> alright, let's go for a walk, shall we? Rebellion. Nothing here? Alright. Yeah, maybe I can like pick up some ingredients while I'm going there, you know? So this is like a hiking trip, you know? I guess the whole point of this game is just to like adventure around, you know? So, uh, yeah, we are doing just, this, just that. Hello, Toadstool. You see that bridge over there? That's the bridge that level, uh, never, level? Never uh, destroy it, you know? So, yeah, we're going to check it out eventually. Revelio. Nothing here. Hey, look, there's a balloon over there on the other side. Never and Seamus, yep. I'm actually not running because running would mean that I might miss some stuff so I'm just walking here. Casually walking. What the heck I could have teleported here. Never mind. <laughs> you didn't see anything. They have... yeah what's this? Bruh. Is that Hagrid's hut? I think so. It has to be Hagrid's hut, right? I mean like right now it's not Hagrid's hut right now, but it's someone's hut. I wonder whose hut is that? Oh, there's a quest! How come I didn't see the quest in the world map? Wait, hold on. Is that a way to zoom? Hmm. 
Why couldn't I see the quest just now? That's so weird. The quest is right there in front of me. That's so weird. I don't think I want to do it later, but I want to do it now. That's the thing. Can I go in? Played casual school uniform. Hagrid's hut. There we go. Groundskeepers too. One might surmise that this uh, tool could be enchanted to create all sorts of furnishing for a cozy hut. Oh, so this could be my location to do some stuff. Cool. Okay, there seems to be a dungeon on the left side. Wait, huh. there's a dungeon on the left side. It's a long way down, that's for sure. Let's check it out. What's all this? Okay, looks like we may have to push this. It says incendio, so... Incendio. Mm, Accio? Levioso. Nope. Accio. Doesn't work. Let's see if I can bring it closer. Oh, yes I can! Wow! Didn't expect that to work. What's this? Seems like a ball can land here. Incendio. Nope, can't burn the ground. Okay, what's all this? Leech juice! Oh. Okay, didn't expect to see something like this here. Let's see what's on the edge of the this area here. Revelio. Nothing here. This place is huge, by the way. Like, ridiculously good. Yeah, I'll go inside the cave later. I just want to see what's on the outside here. Nothing around here. Do you know how ridiculous how big this place is? Like, you just think about it. You know? One man just walking around. Crazy. I'm guessing that uh, cave it's going to have some kind of a uh, ball that I need to pull out later, right? I'm guessing. Moonstone, all right. Wait, huh? What the heck? What if I bring it down to here? What, what will happen? Oh! Wow! Okay, that was weird. Okay, I think there might be a ball in here somewhere. I should investigate. Yes, of course. Uh, first things first, I need my Lumos. Uh, Lumos! Revelio! Anything here? No. Lumos! Okay, there's a chest here. Your gear slot are full, Jesus man. Not again. Alright. We have way too much gear right now. We gotta throw away some stuff. Alright, so this one is no good. $60. Yeah, I can throw this one away. Unbeatable Quidditch glove. Alright. Let's check it out. Did you refund the game already, 88? It's literally the same glove. Oh, oh, this one you can sell for $90, alright. Wait, the cave seems to be empty. Why is it empty though? Like, there's literally nothing here. Revelio.
Incendio. Hmm. Weird. All right. Let's go outside. Revelio. This is weird. Like, what are we supposed to do here? Okay, never mind. You know what? We'll keep going, okay? I think we're good to go for now. Yeah, I think it's just a chest, perhaps. Yeah, possible. Never mind. Time to meet Natty. Okay, there's a animal here. Hey, there's a guy with the quest here. The heck? There's so many quests around. I, ca I can't see on the map. Might I beseech you for some assistance? Yes, please. Hello. Uh, can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes. My name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Underwater adventurer? Hmm. Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid! Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Mm. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. You seem to think I might have heard of the Bath Pinch Smedleys. Why would I know your family? That's like asking why the sky is blue or grass is green. The Pinch Smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. Really? We are known for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. But with all I plan to discover about the world around us, those that don't yet know the name certainly one day will. What exactly is an astrolabe? It's an astonishing ancient navigational tool. Essentially, a handheld model of the universe. It's mainly used for studying the stars, astronomical pursuits, but it has nearly a thousand uses fascinating device sadly i'd imagine it's rusted beyond repair now still we'd love to have it returned to us it would be like getting a bit of my grandparents back all right hmm it sounds dangerous especially for something of mere sentimental value i understand but i'd be forever grateful of course you may discover much more than the astrolabe anything else you found would be all yours I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. How can she calculate exactly I how hope you where find the, the thing would be at? It yeah. would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Can I actually dive down in this game? That's the question here, you know? Okay, let's try that quest, alright? Before that, we will do the astrolabe first. Alright, let's do some astrolabe, shall we? It is good to see you, my friend. 
Uh, yes, good to see me. Well, you know, don't want to see you too right now, because busy with astrolabe stuff. <laughs> I've always said that travel. I'll be back. Hey, it's not my fault, okay? There's just so much stuff to do right now. Okay, the question now is, can I actually dive, you know? Alright, let's go. This must be where the Pinch Smedley family astrolabe is. Okay, so how do you dive? Oh, there's something here. Oh, you don't actually dive. Your slots are full again. My god, are you kidding me? I have to go sell stuff already after this. Like, instantly. I'm trying to sell some $60 stuff right now. Like this one. Hunter finger gloves. Okay, let's check it out. Is it any better? Yes, it is. It's actually quite good. Can I swim any faster though? <sighs> okay, gotta clear more stuff. <laughs> this is ridiculous, man. The hat is $90. Maybe I can just throw away this one. Dueling glove, Jesus man, so many stuff. Oh, alright, not bad. Time to sell this one then. So many things to check here. Autumn scarf, how nice. Okay, let's check it out. Scarf. Ooh. It's a legendary scarf as well. That is kind of cool. Alright, I'll just destroy this one then. Wow, two things. Astrolab and Wigan Welt Potion. Sweet. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. Okay, there's something here. Knitted jumper attire. Where is it? Nice. At least you don't have stamina as a game, I was thinking that too. Like, imagine I have stamina, right? Already with too many things to focus on, this would be even more painful to, like, focus. Alright, this is good. Let's go. Oh, what's that? 
Oh my god, you can skip rocks? Are you serious? What the hell? That's kind of cool. Of course, the animation of the skipping rock looks like shit, you know? In Genshin, you sin and then stamina, no stamina, you die. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. This one you can run forever. Find the dive too terribly difficult. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? I did, and I'm keeping. <laughs> I did, and it's yours for a price. Oh no! I feel like I want to get money for this. I'm not a kind half or puff. Like, I cannot just give because I almost drown. Obviously, there's no stamina here. But, you know, I could say that I almost drown, right? So, sell it to her. Yeah, I know, right? I did, but it wasn't easy. I shall need to be compensated. I see. That's fair, I suppose. A reward, so to speak, for finding the buried treasure. Yes, of Thank course. Thank you for recovering it. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Give me my stuff. Thank you again. Twenty dollars. Keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. Ooh, mermaid mask. Are you serious? You only give me twenty dollars for that? You must be joking. Okay, where's the mask? Oh, I think the mask is just for a decoration, though. There it is. Wow. Nope. It's too much. Alright, let's go sell some stuff, shall we? I wish there's a place I can sell stuff right now. It is good to see you, my friend. Yeah, I can sell stuff here. Nope. Not here. I just I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this <gasps> Hello. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello, I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Any whispers going about the town? A goblin called Pergit is causing a bit of a stink. His gang is attacking travelling vendors, and now business is suffering everywhere. Uh, it would be nice if someone would do something about it. No one wants to pick a fight with a band of goblins, though. <laughs> Which means he's free to do what he wants down in Coral Ruins. Coral Ruins, alright. Can you tell me a bit about yourself? Oh, let's see. Well, I am Lord Hogsfield's preeminent potioneer. And I was once a lowly Hogwarts student like you. In fact, I'll give you the Hogwarts discount. <laughs> it's the standard price. Oh my, my god. price is low enough already, you see. <laughs> I'll give you a discount. That's the standard price. <laughs> Jeez. What do you have for sale? I sell only potions and their ingredients. If you can't fix it with a potion, then it's best left broken, I say. <laughs> my ingredients are all local to this area, and my potions are brewed to keep you healthy and safe. All right. What do you have for sale? Okay, let's see what, what he can has I help for sale. You with I want to get some lace wing flies. Do I? No, I want some. I want some Wigan Weld actually, but I don't want to skip. I don't want to spend. I feel like it's a bit of waste, but uh, I'll just buy two. Ah yes, a wonderful choice. Leech juice, toad stew, lace wing fly. I think lace wing fly. I can find it though. So, okay, let's sell some stuff, shall we? Okay, we're going to sell this guy. I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. Sell this one. Sell this one. I'm basically selling everything at this point. Oops, not this one. All right, perfect. I hope to see you again sometime. Thank you. I can finally pick up items now. There's a treasure. There's a chest over here. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. 
Ooh, so many stuff to pick up. Uh, there we go. Revelio. Dark Herbologist Hat. Wow. That's an interesting name. Let's go inside. Anything in here? Striped Sleeping Cap. How do you accue that thing? It's so high up. Lady, I'm trying to steal your stuff, alright? So just stay calm. Stay calm, lady. Yep, thank you. Thank you for the five bucks. Rebellion. Oh, there's a chest over there. I didn't see it just now. Spiderweb head. Alright. Looks like I'm going to sell more stuff after this. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Oh man, I cannot get in. When will I learn Alohomora? That's crazy. That's crazy, I haven't learned it yet. I never thought Ramrock's Loyalists would go this far. Alright, it looks like I cannot get into that one. Alright, so let me see what's inside. Going out. Alright, see you later, 88. Thanks for joining, man. Enjoy your night. Hello, Mr. Sammy. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? I hope to see you again sometime. Streaming after dinner? Probably. I'm going to be playing a lot today. So yeah. You might see me later again. Cute. I never thought Ramrock's... Pardon me. Is everything alright? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. Oh, I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. Has Ranrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? Oh, they've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. But they've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Ramrock is getting more powerful and his loyalists know it. They feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him. 
But he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. You mentioned that your paintings were taken. Are you a painter? I am. It's my calling, though most would think it an unusual path for a goblin. Most of my family work in metal, or associated with Gringotts. I'd wager my finest brush that Ramrock's lot have no appreciation for any of my work, and it'll be tossed aside for kindling. Without my carts and my livelihood, who knows when I'll be able to paint again. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. Okay, I have to walk quite far though. Jesus, man, that's quite far. I'll do your quest a bit later, bro. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. After what Ramrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. <sighs> Rebellion! It's good to see you, my friend. It is good to see you. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A portkey brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. I... What does that mean? I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it. And I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now. It is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us, to all of us, which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack, and I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibililand. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true. But shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow was planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Hmm. Okay. I beg your pardon! How dare you threaten me! What's going on here?
They must have come this way. Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student! You can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupid <laughs> What are you Let's doing? Do oh. Incendio. Uh, ah. I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. The collection section of your field guide has been updated with new type of enemy. You learn valuable inside the enemy such as weakness and spells. been accosted in such a manner than so close to Hogwarts. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin, gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. Typical hard-working Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner, has her own shop in Nocturn Alley. She's a travelling vendor, hears what's going on in the Highlands before I do. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service, historian and archaeologist specialising in Merlin's work and life. I thought that Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them, all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the Trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has a symbol in the centre. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the centre of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honours? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent.
this trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the mallow sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each mm. trial has these features. Place the mallow sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. Uh... See that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Incendio! Mullen's beard! The flames make the pyre sink. That's cool. The pyres are back where they started. Oh, I gotta do them all. Okay. Incendio. Oh, I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swell on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require mallow sweet, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. And do be careful out here. Now I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, wow, that's so cool. <laughs> a portrait in our common room wants to talk to you. It's Eldritch Diggory. He used to be the Minister for Magic, I think. Oh, uh, Diggory. All right. There's another Merlin trowel here. Let's, let's let's check it out. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Could it be a Merlin trial? Interesting. Levioso, Akio. Is that all? Okay. Levioso. Incendio. Expel 
Expelliarmus! Incendio! Oh, there's another one here. Revelio. Rebellion.
Revelio. What do you have in store for me this time? Incendio! Expelliarmus! Levioso! Accio! This could prove dangerous if I'm sorry. Revelio. This looks intriguing. Levioso. Accio. Protege. Stupid one. 
That's that. Settled. Revelio. Rebellion. I should investigate. Rebellion. Incendio. Rebellion. Accio. Revelio.
Revelio. An encampment. This must be it. to enter. Accio! Most gobblers in my family worked in the mines at one time or other. Accio! <laughs> Incendio! <laughs> Levioso! Oh, you are there. Accio! You can say it's excellent defense against the dark hearts, I see. I know what that means. Much. Levioso! Accio! Incendio! Expelliarmus! That was quite something. Now, to free Arn's carts. Incendio! Revelio! Incendio! Incendio! Rebellion! Critego! Expelliarmus! Incendio! Accio! Ah. 
here. See what's up your sleeve this time, Marlin. Akio. Rebellion. <sighs> Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. Rebellion. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Rebellion. Expelliarmus! Incendio! Accio! 
La vie est seule. Revelio. Rebellion. Incendio Accio This Merlin Charles won't get the best of you. Revelio.
Revelio. It's like a place right out of a storybook. If you're here for my wares... On, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I, d I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. The ones I faced were determined to make things difficult. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. All the best to you. Once my carts arrive, I'd be happy to show you my wares. Why don't you have a little peruse? There we are, then. That'll do nicely, I'm sure. More than happy to purchase that. Good to have stock, I always say. Appreciate you stopping by. Uh, be sure to... Don't you have a little peruse? Appreciate you stopping by. Uh, be sure to visit me again, won't you? I wonder who lives here.
I know a Merlin trial when I see one. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent, outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class. Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill, a test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. Akio. Nothing to it. Akio. That was one for the ages. Try to beat that. Missed the mark a bit on that one. Akio. All in the wrist. Akio. <laughs> Wait, did I win? I won! We should have bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? I'm game for another round. Grand! You could use the practice. Summoner's 
Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. Akio. Nothing to it. Akio. That was one for the ages. Lucky shot. of good luck, that's all. Come now, Leander. There's no need for that. Fine, you're good. Better than I am, at least. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. The others? I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Chin up, Leander. Keep practising and you'll get better. I suppose you're right. I'll let the others know that your metal's been tested, and that you passed. Rebellion. That's it. Rebellion. Hey, it's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. Heard him talking about taking responsibility. Professor Sharp was annoyed, but we sorted it out. No harm. Cheers to that. He probably had a good chuckle after we left. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. You and your concoctions. 
I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing Wisbys is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Of course. You never know when you might need a quick means of escape from the castle. Brilliant, thank you. But you should know that it's not exactly quick. It's the secret bit that's helpful. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. Couldn't you have someone buy the dried billywigs things? They're not for sale, and you never know when the cellar's going to be locked. So, the reliable way in and out is through the secret entrance. Are you asking me to steal from a shop? Goodness! It's not as if I'm asking you to rob Gringotts. Honeydukes is more than enough, and I only need a few. It's a sweets ingredient. They won't be missed, trust me. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. I'll need to get those dried... Gareth, if he's to finish his latest concoction. Revelio. A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. Damn it. Revelio. Revelio. Revelio.
This looks like the right statue. Password. Revelio. You should return to me often. Ancient secrets bring forth an age of magic. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Revelio. 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 Where is it? Nice to see you, my young friend. I can sense someone close to you needs your help. Revelio. Where is it? Oh, it's up there. Revelio.
incendium. Goodness, who knew this was all down here? Revelio. A lift must be how I get down. Looks broken though. Accio. Levioso. Need to fix the lift before I can use it. Repair it. That seems to have done the trick. This castle will never cease to surprise me. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Rebellion. Revelio.
Revelio. Levioso. <laughs> Get across. Repair her. Levy over. Something is getting in the way of that platform. <laughs> Perhaps I should cast Accio to get that frame out of the way first. Accio! Did the trick. Revelio. This must be the way out. I need to find a way to open that gate. Incendio. Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey dukes. Hogsmeade, here I come. Of the dried billywigs things. Now back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out.
Revelio. 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 Accio. Revelio. Incendio Levioso Reparo Accio Revelio Lumos Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelio. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Oh. 
Lumos. Yo, what's up, man? Yeah, this hawks me. I'm trying to do some quests right now. Can't figure out where the hell is this thing. I think it's on that side. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Hmm. Looking for a pink tree. Follow the arrow. No, no, no. It's, the arrow is a different quest. It's around here somewhere. Oh crap, he saw me. Where's the invisibility one? Barbecue chicken pizza. Damn, man. Now you're making me hungry. <laughs> Need some things here. There's another chest over there. Ah, it's over there. I see it. You see that butterfly over there? That's what I'm looking for. Stay invisible. Lumos. I was invisible just to open the chest. That's it. So yeah, I was trying to look for this guy. There it is. It was just next door only. Jesus Christ, man. Rebellion. There's so many chests right that is locked behind doors like Alahomora is not available right now. Ooh, this one has a lot of stuff. There's something else here. Hogsmeade, here I come. Ooh, that's a big chest, man. Pattern cloak. Let's check it out. First year, learn that spell. I know. I have no idea why I haven't learned that yet. It's crazy, man. Nope. So many new items. Nice. I like this one. But it looks like Ravenclaw. One second, yeah.
All right, I am back. What happened to my hair? All right, here we go. Rebellion. I just realized that the last time I was here, right, I completely missed out a lot of stuff in Hogsmeade. Like, so many things I completely didn't do yet. So, yeah. But Alohomora is definitely one of those spells that I need right now, which I do not have, so... <laughs> Probably might just come back again just for the sake of Alohomora. You know? So many locks everywhere. Ooh, flying pages. Ooh, there's another thing there. Yep. There's so many things locked in here. I want that thing. There we go. Alright, there's something, something inside here. Wait, no, it's right here. Ah, oh, hello! Alright. Invisible time. Ah, oh, shit. Lumos. Okay, how many memorize this, okay? This is... There's a big barrel near a house. Alright. Big barrel near a house. Can't miss it. Think about it. It's a big-ass barrel near a house. How can anyone miss that? Ah, here it is. Big barrel. Yeah, house. Okay, I think it's on the other side. Found it. Rebellion. Yay, found it. Oh, there's something over there. Lumos. Follow me. It seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Rebellion. Ah, oh, shit, it's over there. Ah, oh, man, the thing disappeared again. Watch the ministry. Still. The red have been a vampire. What's the point of having a child Lumos. Follow me. Rebellion. Many stuff locked away. Can't do anything about it. Okay, there's a chest over there. Anything on here? I think I pretty much covered most of the stuff. Alright, I think I'll come back again. 
What's oh. that? Ah, it's the eye. So many chests with this eye thingy. Perfect. Rebellion. Nothing here. Anything up here? You might as well watch. Action! Rebellion! Actually, I have three, three more pages to go, so maybe I can just hang around first. Told you not to go down oh, that path. This guy. Miss Peck from Brood and Peck said a customer lost a deer all around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought you could have got us in a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Instead, I just wasted. Revelio. Huh. Finally, I'll have enough for that wind wisp. Ah, well, to get any. Not meant to be. See that hawk's meat. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Akio. <laughs> Ooh, two more. So many chests, man. Rebellion. Action. One more to go. One more to go. Where are you? Rebellion. I can't get in. Everything's inside this shop. Right? Okay, one more book. One more flying book. What happens if you're invisible, you go near the chest, you can't open it. It will like look at you and stuff, so you have to be invisible only you can open the chest. You know what I mean? It's a cool mechanic if you ask me. Rebellion. Oh, I think that's it. Or oh, is that a freaking bird? If that's a book, then I've completed what I'm looking for. Yes, that's it. We found it. Action. Sweet! 15 out of 15, got it. Rebellion. Yep, he will look at you. Here, I show you. See? He will look at you and then you cannot open it. So he's like, even if you go invisible in front of him, he won't let you open it, you know? It's only when you're out of his sight and then you go invisible and then you can open it. <laughs> it's a very cool kit mechanic. I like it. I really like it, you know? Rebellion. Okay, I think we're pretty much done with Hawksme. Let's go back. Okay, gotta go back to this dude. You know what I always wanted to do but I never did? Go down to the docks, the boathouse. Let's check it out. I wanna check out the boathouse. And then after that, I think I'm gonna go have dinner. I have been playing for two and a half hours again. <laughs> on another adventure, are right. we? I, I feel like this game is very addictive. Like I could literally play side quests all day long. Oh man, I hate you, peeps. No dinner to you are seven. I'm gonna die, man. <laughs> Hello again. Were you able to get? Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them. Incredible. All yours for a fee. Well, you know. Obviously. Getting them was more work than I expected. I'd like to be paid for my time. Of course. Didn't think it would be that much trouble, but I'm happy to pay for your help. I wonder Thank how much he's going to give me. I'll let 20 you know bucks. when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. How much you give me? Come on. How much do you give me? 300 bucks. Sometimes you gotta, you know, be aggressive, you know. Uh, no year 6 and 7, yeah I know. It's only year 5 for this game, I think. Anyway, in terms of quest-wise, I think we're pretty much done with all of the quests. Oh, Portrait of Eldrick Diggory, by the way, there's a Diggory in this, so... Uh, yeah, 
Diggory's great great grandfather. Year six comes out DLC. Oh, that'll be so cool. I might do this one, but I want to go down to the boathouse first. You know, I've always been thinking about going down to the boathouse. It's gonna be of a walk though, so let's go. Let's go visit the boathouse. Revelio. Nothing here. I wonder if I can see some books stuff here. Man, look at this. Look at this. How beautiful this place is, man. Crazy. I want in. I'm sorry your uh, computer cannot support it, but you should really get a refund as soon as possible. And then, yeah, you can wait for the Switch version. You will get it eventually, you know. And I guarantee you, even after a few more months later, you only you play it, it will still be worth it. Like, trust me. It's really good. Getting refund. Good job, man. Man, coming down to the boathouse is freaking far. Revelio. Yeah. Something inside. Ah, this is the location where Snake dies. You know? What is this thing here? Oh. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I, I never thought about doing Rebellion. that. Okay, there's nothing else here. Oh wait, oh yeah, there's nothing here. Unless PS5 giveaway. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> okay. I think we can do one more quest because I'm I feel like doing that one more quest. Alright. Let's do that one more quest, then I'm gonna have dinner. Oops. Uh where is it? This one is Prisoner of Love. Is that the- wait, is that the main quest? Oh shit, it is the main quest. Ah oh, man, it's the main quest. Never really liked the idea of doing main quests because, you know. Oh man. Alright. Main quest it is then. Just a little bit. PS4 giveaway. I actually gave away my PS4 to one of my friends because they didn't have a PlayStation at all. Since I got my, my PS5, you know. Let's see how many have I done already. There is the... I've done quite a few of the lock thingy, so I want to see how much have I done. Where is it? Where's the chest for that? I think it's in here. There it is. That's it. I'm making good progress with those tokens. How many did I do already? I think I made I did a few. This Dedalian Keys challenge is coming along nicely. Nice! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. I already did half. Exactly half. Sweet. Alright, main quest. Let's go. Revelio. Okay, there's nothing here. Hello, Eldrick Diggory. You wanted to see me, sir? Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself. So few students know who I am these days. Eldridge Diggory, former Minister for Magic and founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. I believe you can help solve a decades-old murder, thanks to that book you found, and, in particular, its missing pages. How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits here more than you might suspect, and most of us can keep a secret. So, what say you? 
Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself would be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. Sure. Murder sounds intriguing. This could be right up my street. Even we Hufflepuffs enjoy a good mystery. Glad to hear you are up to the challenge. Plus, I believe you'll benefit from this undertaking. My great niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but was a skilled aura in her day. And the unsolved murder of which I speak was her case. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? How could a few pages of a book help her solve an old case? A boy disappeared with those pages, but they never found the body. A girl was convicted of his murder nonetheless. Oh no. It seems those pages could exonerate her somehow. My great niece can tell you more. Can you tell me more about your great niece? Cream of the crop when it comes to auras. A star pupil here, and then an exemplary servant to the ministry. And her spark hasn't diminished one bit in her retirement. She and I often chat about old cases and our glory days. No offense, but it's nice to get away from the students and converse with someone who's familiar with my legacy. When were you the Minister for Magic? Over a hundred years ago. 1733 wow. to 1747, to be Holy precise. Crap. The stories I could tell you. Oh, didn't have the chance to do all that I could. I was in the midst of reforming Azkaban when my life was cut short by dragon pox. I was sneezing sparks to the bitter end. Damn. Uh, it's our degree in Hufflepuff. Yes, yes. I shall go and see her right away. Brilliant. With what I suspect is your knack for hard work and her keen mind, both mysteries may be solved sooner than you think. It's like Weasley in uh, I shall Gryffindor. See you there. Soon, I hope. Okay, let's go. How far is she? She's 1,100. Holy shit, where the f... <laughs> She's so far away! Why do I have to walk so far? Jesus, man. Where the heck is she? Bro. She's way past Hogsmeade. She's way past Hogsmeade, man. I ain't gonna go there. I can go here, though. Magic Cup emotes. Oh my god, he's so far away. Nah, I think I'm just gonna do this and then I will uh, do that later. I'm gonna get a bit hungry. I feel like that is like a bit of a distance. Thank you for the spam. I'll do that later. I'm, I, I'm going to play a bit more before I sleep. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Alright, so we have some trials to do. Wow, that's a lot of... Dude. No stream after dinner? Uh, okay, so here's the thing. You know how I upload like an episode after episode on YouTube? I'm starting to think if, if that's even considered wise or even needed, you know? It is a very long thing and I don't think people actually watch it. So if I do play, I think I might do play at my own time already at this point. Sometimes I might stream, sometimes I might not, so yeah. Rebellion. We are destroying hits. What's that? Settled. Sweet. Playing off stream, imagine. I, I might still stream though, but I don't know. It depends. It depends. It's because if I do stream on bed, because I have a TV in front of my bed, right? I, you know, I can't really stream when I'm on the bed. You know what I mean? Oh, I, I'm not sure if you ever see me encounter. Uh, Spiders, not worth the trouble if you ask me. Like the fucking 
Oh, there's poachers here. <laughs> Jesus Christ, what? Perhaps you want to let me I know he said your poaching days are over, but I hear I am poaching his stuff here. Yeah. Don't mind if I do. Rebellion. Free money, you know. Allow me to put you out of your misery. What? There's another dude there? Where are you? There's another dude up there. Rebellion. There's another dude up there. Okay. Let's go. Why are they poaching eggs? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Alright, come here. Revelio. Twilight Cloak. Oh, that looks really good. That looks really good. Twilight Cloak. Don't mind if I do. Let's check it out. Ooh, I like this one. This one looks good. Right? I have a lot of collections to do, man. A lot. Anyway, yes. Uh, if you want, I can stream again later before I sleep. But I'm going to go have dinner first. Okay? Alright. I'll see you later, man.